Hi everybody, it's been a while since I posted but hopefully this will be something enjoyable to watch and to learn from. It's been a very busy term, I'm sure for everybody. It seems like the older we get, the faster the time flows. In this video I'm going to discuss a few short anime series that I have recently watched and would really recommend if you're looking for something to watch this winter break. Some of them are on Netflix which means that the licenses will probably run out soon so you might want to catch them before they're gone. Let's start with the first one. If you're looking for something light-hearted, but with a meaning, like all animes are pretty much with a meaning, um, I would recommend How to Keep a Mummy, which is available on Crunchyroll. It's 12 episodes and it's really sweet, the main character looking after a little portable mummy um, and the needs that it has and the way you have to look after it, obviously in many ways you have to be very cautious, but it's just really sweet how their friendship between the two develop and also what adventures the little mummy takes on the main character. Second one, if you're looking for something a little bit more dramatic um, from a thriller kind, uh, Erased would be something for you to watch. Um, this anime has actually been recommended to me by my friend uh, Olita, who's a composer as well. Shout out! Really, I'm, I'm really grateful that she introduced me to that one. It really does keep the audience in suspense pretty much throughout the whole series and it's again really interesting. It's quite a dark story, it features the main character leaping through time just before something is about to happen but that sort of changes throughout the whole anime. Uh, he also has a mystery to solve. It's not a very long series so you can definitely squeeze it in this winter break. The third one, this one is something definitely for musicians and if you're into classical music and anime, I think this anime combines those two very beautifully and it tells a story about a young high school and pianist who meets um, a violinist and their journey together through many obstacles and to be honest, um, watching as a musician I'm really admiring how much detail went into the creation of uh, the animation and the detail of the music expression and you know the expertise like really beautifully put together and actually if I'm very honest um, as I was watching it um, on my journeys to work um, a lot of the times recording sessions or performances it has really inspired me to appreciate what I do and to find a different perspective of lo looking at it so there you go I think you really enjoy it even if you're not a musician but if you are even more so. Next one, so this one is exclusively on Netflix and, and it's actually a Netflix original called Violet Evergarden. Um, it features a very touching story, not a light one, and it's not necessarily based on real life setting, but it does obviously feature a lot of connections with history events. Um, they are however set in an imaginary land. It tells the story of a young woman who has been designed to actually be a weapon and for anybody to be involved in a war it just takes so much on you really this th there were many episodes that really kept me so close to crying i did actually shed a few tears once traveling on the tube and um that just shows how strong this anime is I i've seen the reviews and they weren't quite as supportive of it but i think it's definitely worth watching again it's a short series anime beautiful story and I think you'll really enjoy it. Violet Evergarden, check it out before it goes. Finally, um, we are looking into something a little bit more light-hearted again, featuring high school uh, students, which again is a very common theme for animes, but nevertheless this one is a little bit more aimed, I guess, at the older audience because of the language used and some of the references. It's called Kokoro Connect and it tells the story of five friends who are experiencing a personality swap which means their personality are swapping bodies with each other and you know that can be a little bit of a challenging experience to develop them as people and to test their friendship boundaries so it's something really interesting if you ever wondered what would happen if that happened to you um, it gets you thinking. If you're looking for any more, I have actually made a video previously talking about seven short anime series that you must watch. I'm including a link right in the description as well if you want to watch the other one. I would say these 12 short animes are definitely worth watching and they're all short series so definitely digestible and if you have lim little time like I do. If you have some travel time to entertain yourself during there you go i hope that you enjoy also this little musical moment